Someone says they know it's time for them to move out. The hanged man, this is Pisces energy. This person's been waiting or, or staying stuck or maybe they still needed to gather new information or get enlightened on something or find a new perspective. This person could have been sacrificing themselves. This person's ready for a change. They're ready to release. They're ready to let go. This person sees things differently now. They may have had to walk a path alone or on their own. They've been going through a period or a time of indecision. They're about to make a crucial decision or um, uh, some crucial moves or action. Knight of Pentacles. This person could have been getting stuck or caught up in a routine. This person's just been like burying themselves in work or the daily grind, responsibilities. This person may be getting ready to start a commitment or they know they have hard work up ahead for them. Maybe they've been putting something off because they know what they're getting ready to do and take steps forward to do. It's going to require a lot of attention, a lot of hard work, and it's a it's going to be a long-term commitment, something that they have to be real serious about. Six of Pentacles reversed. I just heard something like, I know I need to help you. Someone knows I need to help you guys or something. This person could have been acting selfish or something like that. There may be some unpaid debts. Somebody could have been stingy or hoarding their money, not sharing their money or wealth with you guys. This may be a, a partnership or it could be a, a parent too. It's something with some responsibilities here. Maybe they was unfair to you or not paying um, child support or something. This could also be someone that wasn't paying their 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 share or um, their part of uh, some bills or something. Two of Pentacles reversed. Somebody's life could have been off balance or disorganized. I feel like someone could be overwhelmed or something like that in regards to a commitment or what's up ahead after they move out of a situation or move out of a home. Judgment. Yeah, they've been doing a lot of reflection, reflection, self-reflection. This person's close to reaching a significant stage in their journey or their life. They may be feeling called to do something or some inner calling, a new phase. This could be something with their purpose too. This person's been doing a lot of awakening, it looks like. The moon reversed. Okay, so now they're starting to release fear. They was, there was lots of fear or maybe confusion or uncertainty, insecurities. Some of you guys, this could be someone that's been repressing or hiding their emotions or their feelings. King of Pentacles. Wow, yeah. This is someone that's been focusing on their accomplishments, achievements, stability, maybe attracting more abundance into their life. This is someone that's typically very confident, successful. You may be trying to find new opportunities for wealth or maybe someone to help you manage your money or wealth or your accounts. This may be someone in a leadership position or a businessman or a woman. This person's just been focusing very 
much on security, their assets, success. This may be something about authority too, prosperity. Comfort. Five of Pentacles reversed. You could be overcoming some financial setbacks or loss, job losses. Could have lost a home or a situation where you aren't feeling financially secure or safe. Maybe that's what the holdup has been or some waiting period has been about. You could have been feeling isolated, alone. So there's a recovery here. This could have been you was in some spiritual poverty like we went over. You was in this mindset, this poverty mindset. You're breaking some generational curses. It looks like possibly surrounding your finance, your finances, financial curses you're breaking. Or just a, a mentality about yourself. You just didn't feel valuable. So there's improvement here. You could have been going through a karmic lessons that you still needed to learn or you needed to wait and, and still find out some more information at a spiritual level about something first. Either way, there's positive changes and someone knows they need to get ready to move out now. Seven of Wands, death. Yeah, there's an ending and then there's going to be a new beginning. There's a change. You've been going through a change, a metamorphosis. This has been a very challenging time for you. You could have been struggling on your journey. Some of you guys could have reached an important milestone. You guys could have been dealing with somebody trying to knock you down, um, trying to challenge your position or get you to quit on yourself, um, try to get you fired or trying to manipulate you or something like that. Either way, you're, you know it's time to go or to leave a situation. Some of you guys, if you're dealing, if this is your person or something, they could have been blocking you guys out. This is what, if this is something like that, this is what they've been doing. They've been trying to uh, like claim their place in the world or rebuild their life, it looks like. Maybe someone unbalanced their life or their, their uh, money or something. There's some kind of transformation here. Let go of uncertainty and allow yourself to start anew. Emperor, you are in this energy where you're respecting yourself a lot more. Like I said, this could be a leader or you're in a leadership position. Now you're focusing a lot more. What's a priority to you? is you're focusing on your stability, creating structure for yourself. This could be a father figure. You're a lot more focused. You could be in this protective type of energy. You're more disciplined. You're more practical. You're feeling more in control of your, your world. So you've just been focusing on hard work. If this could be bringing you great rewards or it soon will. Your hard work could be getting ready to pay off. Some of y'all, this may, this may be new responsibilities you're getting ready to take on or some projects or some hobbies. Justice reverse. Okay, so you was dealing with some injustice or something. Maybe karmic injustice. Somebody could have created an, created an ending for you to where your life was off balanced or you had setbacks or you couldn't, um, your life was disorganized, you couldn't uh, keep up with things, you couldn't pay your bills or something for a short amount of time. Or like I said, you was homeless or something, jobless, health issues. This may, if, if this is your person, you may be dealing with somebody that was irresponsible or this could be a father that was irresponsible or 
non-committal or didn't want to pay child support or didn't want to help you or something this may be why maybe because they've been going through some other stuff these are masculine energies coming out the lovers yeah a lot of y'all this is about us this is your soulmate that's going through this or this is you a soulmate that is you feel like you need to move out now yeah a lot of y'all haven't been talking to somebody significant you know that you need to move or something you have another option or another choice or um a significant partnership or something mercury energy yeah um a lot of y'all haven't been talking so now it looks like this person is going to be focusing on love harmony uh, a significant relationship a union maybe they want to literally partner up with someone and move in with someone else you guys are have your core values could be aligning to you're more in alignment with somebody the full new beginnings just just slid out the full new beginnings this could be something unexpected happening to new beginnings new possibilities innocence so there's a fresh new life here new adventure this it looks like a man or some men some masculine energy this could be divine masculine this person's about to take a risk take a leap of faith and have a new start and move up out of the house mature man toil and labor yeah he just been working and stuff he's been working focusing on his job he could be working in a trade or something or um some kind of skills or um electrical or something or plumber Yeah, Spirit says a tradesman. Something like that. They know it's time for them to move out. First house, enterprise. He's been focusing on some enterprise projects. This person could, some of y'all could, he could be self-employed or independent or a boss. Or he's in a position where he has to be a leader. A leadership position where he's well respected or something like that Jupiter and Aries yeah he's learning something with leadership or something like that Mercury and Pisces inspiration so yeah, it's it's this twelfth house. There's a house here too. He knows it's the end. He knows some journey or situation is over. A living situation with house is over. He could be feeling inspired or getting some inspiration from someone or somewhere. Some of you guys, what I'm hearing is like this person is still single. A lot of you guys, if you haven't talked to this person in a while, your soulmate, um, he's still single. Saturn in Aquarius. He could have been going through something a past Saturn cycle maybe like two three years ago or something like that secrets some secrets could be coming out or he found out some secrets maybe this person is just secretive or they've been secretive venus and scorpio this could be some kind of mystery too. I get a sense like he's been in some mysterious energy 
with this hanged man energy hanged man this Pisces energy Scorpio yeah um, moon in Virgo order he's just trying to get his life in order that's what he's been doing so if you ain't talked to this person and they've been distant or ghost and stuff he could be networking and stuff that's what he's mainly focused on trying to get his life in order or back in order he's focused on his full-time job or something or full-time business okay so this man that he knows it's time to move out or some men possibly could be two men some of you guys this could be some twin brothers or something okay some man mature man that's knows he needs to move out disturbance reversed okay what I'm seeing intuitively is like a lot of you guys he could have had the phone on like do not disturb mode and stuff or he didn't want to be disturbed by other people or didn't really want to socialize with people this is coming out reversed now so I feel like this person is going to start wanting to socialize and stuff Some of you guys, this person, he didn't believe in like supernatural things or uh, stuff with the occult or some spiritual stuff. He could have been experiencing something like paranormal or some kind of paranormal activity that helped uh, awaken him somehow. Some like odd behavior or things just out of the out of the normal, unusual things. Care, parented patron support this could be a father figure or something like that or they have responsibilities as a father he he may be getting ready to move out of a house a home or someone else's place or something or what or sell his house or what either way he's gonna be supporting something or someone or a child possibly that's for some of you guys marriage maybe supporting a spouse too or getting ready to he wants you to be dependent upon him dependency is here or um, he wants you to feel like you can count on him that's a better word I, I think <clears throat> dependency um, some of you guys I, I feel like it's it's he wants to help you not like you're just totally you're at his mercy or something um, what else calm reversed somebody can't keep calm Frightened. Somebody feels like they're in trouble now. Is what Spirit says. Frightened. Family reversed. Memories reunion. Okay, someone else in this energy is is, is scared or something. Frightened. This may be someone that was causing issues or had his life off balance or played a part in that, possibly in the past. Whoever that is 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 terrified and scared about him getting his life in order or that he has gotten his life in order they may have not have wanted him to be in a family dynamic or to support you this person is like hella scared someone's hella scared I don't know if that's a karmic energy or what but Who is this that can't keep calm? Scared? Frightened? Somebody very reckless and impulsive. A karmic. I'm trying to keep control of this masculine at all costs. Unsuccessful on online dating sites. Okay, so it's a karmic. Some reckless, impulsive karmic. 
I feel like this person played a life in trying to ruin or destroy or keep control over this person somehow. They can't believe this person's life is back in order and stuff. Spirits let me know like that karmic knows they're in trouble now. Like they're they're screwed now. Feeling nostalgic. Someone's thinking about the past or something like that. They're afraid to contact you. This man could have used poor logic in the past. Someone's unhappy and they hate it where they're at. Wherever this man is at or living at, he hates it there. I'm going to propose marriage to you. Stop trying to save them and let them deal with their own karma. They love how smart and intelligent you are. Someone divorced. They keep texting and calling you from fake phone numbers. They tricked you. Letting dead weight go. Get with the program. Okay, so this car mix, they're going crazy. Maybe he lives with this karmic. Okay, I'm not gonna, I'm gonna try to not focus too much on the karmics. Let's just see what's up with this man. Cause he's not in karmic energy. He just seems like maybe he was a victim to something. Okay, and he hates where he's at. He's unhappy where he's at. Eight of Cups reversed. He's getting ready to leave soon. Three of Pentacles reversed. Ace of Swords reversed. Someone confused him or something. He could be getting ready to communicate to you soon. Someone don't want him to be involved with you or help you, support you, or live with you or something like that. This could be a karmic that lied on you guys too. King of Wands reversed. This could be a karmic masculine. Eight of Swords. Yeah, there's some people that are trying. It could be a group of people. There's some people that are trying to keep him stuck and trapped. They know that he hates living there or whatever, but they don't want him to leave. They're trying to make sure he don't leave at all costs. Seven of Cups. They're trying to keep him in an illusion or something like that. They could not want him thinking for himself. They, they're trying to keep him stuck, basically. Someone's trying to make him feel like he's supposed to be staying stuck wherever he's at, wherever he's hating being at. He got tricked or something. He could have accidentally, a lot of y'all, he could have accidentally ended up at someone's house. He wasn't even supposed to be over there. He got tricked into going to someone's house or something. I'm afraid to contact you. He could feel like an idiot or something. Seven of Wands reversed, judgment reversed. He made some bad decisions or something like that. A bad judgment call on something. He didn't see something. He... It, it was too late already before when he found something out. Somebody did something to get him to to, um, to fall, give up on himself, or quit or something. He feels like he made a bad judgment call. Maybe this person's embarrassed or something. Afraid to contact you. Strength reversed. Yeah, there is something with their ego or pride or insecurities. Maybe they feel ashamed or something. Something from the past. Maybe a past cycle.
some of you guys he ignored the red flags afraid to contact you this could be your ex six of cups reverse ten of pentacles reverse yeah something about the past he he lost something in the past or lost everything maybe or was homeless but things have changed now for most of these men where they're at today in life it's different now they're in a position where they can move out or something nostalgic yeah so someone is thinking a lot about the past or this is him thinking about the past okay who is this because he's trying to let go of dead weight or whoever is dragging him down who is this that can't keep calm this karmic reckless impulsive karmic maybe he did something reckless behind whoever this is can't keep calm frightened it's a person that's trying to have him stuck they don't want him learning new things they don't want him ascending they don't want him having positive changes they don't want him getting out of this misfortune the devil this is a karmic ten of pentacles reversed that person may be panicking because they know he's getting ready to move up out of a house they're trying to make sure he he doesn't uh, become ambitious or successful or doesn't get back to that position they want him to be broken stuff yeah they want him to be a punk basically king of king of wands reversed wow Some of you guys, what I'm sensing, like they want him to be a sorry person. They want him to be a, a punk and stuff. Like they want him to feel like he's no good for nothing. He ain't useful or something. Anyways, it doesn't matter because whoever's trying to keep control over him don't have no control. Yeah, four of pentacles, they're trying to hold and cling on to this person. Wheel of Fortune reverse, Ace of Pentacles. They could be trying to control something with their their income, their money, or a new job or something, or new work opportunities, new business ventures and stuff. Whatever the universe is helping this person with as far as new opportunities for money and stuff in abundance. So this karmic, whoever, they don't have no control over this at all. 